Hello, Mr. Biggers, you're so used to be Rachel, and we're back with another episode of White Island Season 1. Where we last left off, it was a lot of death. <laughs> I'll just tell you that much, a lot of death. But now we're at the lighthouse, sh shining the light, and we're going to see if we can find anyone through all this death. Let's see how it goes. Alright, so we got the lighthouse working. Now, I don't know what to do. Uh, I'll figure that out. Alright, don't be shocked, okay? It was that I found out that Detective Day Han has been killed. What? Oh my god. Detective Day Han too. Even if we found other people, the killer could be among them. It's not going to be easy to catch them. I never knew this island would be this scary. If I did, I would never... No, no. There's got to be a way. Wait. What about the gun? The gun that I have? Gun? What gun? The one that Detective Dayan was carrying. The one that I have. Oh no. What if the gun is picked up by someone else? Like me? Oh, I see. She's worried that the killer might get the gun. Well, I'm the killer, baby. Boom. Don't worry, Sayahun. I brought the gun with me. Oh. What a relief. The gun is not in the wrong hands. Sayahun. But the truth is, I'm really scared to carry this gun with me. If not for you... How come no one's coming? I hope nothing has happened to them. Sehun, listen. What's up? We've got to get off this island. That should be our first priority. But, how about the other people who are still on this island? You could be in the worst danger. Just trust me this time. We've got to escape from this island. What should we do then? We'll have to make contact with the outside first. Alright. I'll stay with you from now on. Oh, great. Now we gotta go get contact with other people from the outside world. How do you expect us to do that? Oh, let's take the dead fisherman's boat. It's not this way. No, wait. It is this way. What am I thinking? I'm dumb. Where's the boat? The boat should be down here. Let's take it. Let's go. Ah! Gee. Won't even move an inch. God dang it. Let's take the chair. Come on, let's go. God dang it. I thought it was an ordinary radio, but it's a two-way radio. I need to find the battery first in order to make it work. But I don't think this radio operates on AA batteries. If that's the place. Can you think of a place? The room in the cave with all the corpses. The room had computers and a lot of high-tech equipment. So it might... Yeah. We might be able to find batteries there. Okay, let's go. Damn it. How do we get down there? This is gonna be a son of a bitch. Or maybe not, because I forgot about that. Damn. I have to go into that terrible cave again? I barely made it out last time. Can't imagine having to wander around in there again. Wait. Jihoon. Look at that. Huh? Is that the map we found in the head's basement? Could be. Hell yeah! Did a detective drop it while passing through here? There's some markings. This might be an important clue. Okay, let's examine it in detail. Oh, um, okay. It's glowing. Using a ticket, you can instantly move to the location on the map where the box is flashing red. We can? We don't have any tickets, damn it. Um, let's see. It has computer with a red mark, the flowers with a red mark, and the cave, the middle of the cave with a red mark. I'm stuck because I don't have ticket. Oh, there we go. Wow, I'm dumb. Okay, let's go find those corpses, and let's figure out what the hell to. Do. I think it's this way. Yeah, and then this way, and then. This way. Hell yeah. Alright, you guys any batteries? No. Nothing. Really? Really, nothing? You guys are weak. You know, I'm wondering something. I'm wondering if we have to go to the locations that are marked with the circle, the red. The flower makes sense. The cave makes a little sense because we found the map there. The computer, I'm not so sure. 
but I guess we'll figure that out. So let's try to go to the flowers first, which is near the lighthouse. Oh. Never mind. Damn. The hammer's broken. It wasn't that strong to begin with. So we got a battery. Okay. Let's get out of here. Go to the radio. Get some backup. And then go to the white flowers just in case if we actually are going to miss something if we don't. Alright, we're at the radio. Will this take this battery? It's not working. Since the battery's dead. God fucking... Wait a minute. This battery... Looks like the same model as the one from the cultivator in front of the clinic. I better check it out. So the big machine-like tractor looking thing? This thing, right? Okay. Looks like it's not charged at all. That's not enough. We have to charge it? Ah, Use it. Damn it. Fuck. Ah. Hey, 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 That broken phone also may have been tampered with by someone under the influence of curse. Shit. Alright, so we know that phone is broken, so that's a f that was the phone. Now, computers, which I'm guessing is the lab, which had a bad... Well, it didn't, doesn't now. But the cave... Is there something more in that cave? Or is there something... In the hospital? No, it's most likely the cave. That's the only reason way that makes sense. Hang on, let me check these places, or let me try to find them. Now there are more red spots. What the hell? Okay, um... Trash? And... I guess... F fuel? Am I really this dumb? No, I'm not. Good. Since I can't start the engine, I should try to recharge the battery manually. Gosh, it's missing a lever. I won't be able to start the engine without a lever. I am dumb. I am dumb. I am completely dumb. Can you please tell me in the comments how dumb I am? Alright, is that good? It should be good. Give me my lever. Lever? Oh, there we go. There, give me my lever. Finally, can I have my lever? Since it doesn't have a battery, turning this lever won't do any good. Okay, I'm guessing I'm not taking my lever. But we can go down to the school now. And put the battery in the radio. See if it works, finally. Hell yeah. How come it's still not working? The battery's fully charged. Is it not getting any reception because of the bad weather? I should give it another try after moving to the highest place on the island. This is too heavy for me. I think I should use a chair to move it. Hey. Hell yeah. Alright, the highest place on the island. That's most likely the lighthouse. Because that's the only th thing I can think of. Let's see. Lighthouse? I can't help. Can we do it? It's not placed in the highest place possible. It won't do any good as long as it has no antenna. We have to grab an antenna? Will this do? Reception should be fine from up here. Oh, thank god. Can't even turn on the power. Jihoon, that radio must be broken. Of course it is. It shouldn't be. I recharged the battery, and I placed it where it should get a good reception. Wait. Is it because... Is it because I got the radio wet in the rain? How stupid of me! Why didn't I think of that? Sayo Hyun, I'm really sorry. I messed up. All the phone lines are dead. And we can't even use this radio. I'm afraid there's nothing else we can do now. Don't be so discouraged. There must be something on this island that could have gotten better by now. Quite a bit of time must have passed. Look outside. The tide's coming in now. Wait. If that's the case... The boat sitting on the mud flat is now floating on the water. I see. Because the tide came in, 
The boat can now sail off. This is great. We might be able to escape from this place even without making contact with the outside. What about the others? Are we really not going to wait for them? Seo Hyun, listen to me carefully, okay? I don't know how this is going to work, but... I believe that means the white flower must be having some kind of deadly effect on people. Deadly effect? That's right. I don't know why, but people here dramatically change because of the white flower. I'm sure the professor is in danger because of this. What the... Oh, it's flashbacks. Oh, yeah. We can't trust anyone on this island anymore. We just can't. Not even each other. Now, let me shoot you. No, I'm sorry. God, I'm sorry. It's a, it's a white flower. Trust me. Anyway, we just have to get away from this place. Ah! What? What's wrong, Jihoon? Are you feeling dizzy again? No, no. It was nothing. We don't have much time now. Now I can't guarantee that I can protect Seo Hyun anymore. Okay, let's go. Jihoon, shouldn't we look around the lighthouse carefully before we leave? Do we need to? We can get off this island once we get on that boat. But, you never know. I think we'd better be sure. Kind of think of it. You're right. But we might need something to start that boat's motor. Like the battery? Okay. Let's go. This boat's the only way for Seo Hyun to escape this island. Oh, so not you. But first, we need to find fuel to get this boat moving. Where could I possibly get fuel? Let's think of places where fuel might be stored. Like the forklift? Or the tractor? Can I take your fuel? No. Can I take your fuel? No, of course not. Why would you want to give me your goddamn fuel? Wait. At first I thought it was the smell of medicine. This is the smell of fuel, right? Where? Where? Is it from you? Are you bleeding fuel? Gimme! Damn it. There's something. Gotta be something in here. Anything. Anything? Anything. Anything. Yes, anything. And it to be quiet. I will cut you and it'll look like a bloody accident. Yes, anything. Now. I'm dumb. What are those old stains on the floor? Really? Could there be a fuel tank underneath? It looks like it can't be opened with my bare hands. There might be some kind of device that controls this in the basement. This must be a device controlling the light being somewhere. If they are cultivating plants, that lighting must be something close to sunlight then. First, I should place the battery where it was before. Okay. It's working now. Let's place the generators near the flower beds. Uh, what the... That's a strong ass light. Seo Hyun! Uh, is she reaching her limit? On top of that, the light must have triggered something to worsen her dizziness. Hey, climb on my back. Uh, let's get out of here now. What the fuck? Uh, uh, should I take her to the to the clinic? Seo Hyun, hurt. Yeah, let's take her to the clinic. Screw the dead guy. Unless we need to go back in here. Or something. But what's this panel for? Is that a solar generator? They couldn't have used sunlight in this dark cave, could they? Yes. There's one place in this cave where light isn't the next best thing to sunlight. No, it's too big and heavy. I don't think I can just carry it around by myself. I gotta use a chair for this. Oh, so this is the generator. Nice. Let's go to the flowers real quick and then get Sarah here into the clinic because, oh my god, please don't die. Here, take that. Let's leave it under the light. Okay, let's leave. It seems to be fully recharged. Let's take it to the computer. Never mind, let's take it back to the office thingy. Please, stay alive, Sayo. Please stay alive! I didn't want Sayo. Oh, whoa, what the? That's trippy.
Uh, how come one of them is yellow? Should I just press it? No. No. Sure. The color changes to green. Does that mean something might have changed there? I better check it out. So, Jung's house. That's near the school. I know where that is. Okay, I know where that is. Alright, let's leave. And get Sarah to the clinic. Maybe. Well, let's check Jung's house first, I guess? I don't know, I'm so confused. Uh, uh, let's go. Jung's house must be this one. Oh, whoa. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Floppy disk. A 3.5 inch floppy disk. The only place to use such a thing would be that big computer inside the cave. Oh, great. We gotta go back to the cave. Alright, floppy disk. Now what? Oh, the hospital's yellow now. Alright, let's go check the hospital. See if that changed anything. Wait, let's check the map. Does that... Okay, that doesn't do anything to the map. I thought it was connected to the map in a way because it showed the red things and we can go to those places. That it might be significant to the story right now. Uh, that made no sense. Alright, where's the hospital? It's up here. Come on, what is at the hospital? We need Seo Hyun into the clinic at least because she is hurt. Uh, let's get you off this bed. Here, Seo. God, fucking. Oh, this. Whoa. What, what did we just get? What did we just get? What the heck? It's about half full. That's great. I should transfer it over to my fuel container. Oh, it's fuel. Oh, that's that's great. Let's go to the boat. And let's get off this island. I do not like this island. It hurts me. It hurts Sayo. Yeah, this is not good. Alright. Huh? Is there someone at the lighthouse? Oh yeah, I see it. It just stops. The light is off. What should I do? Should I go over there? I don't know. Sayo Hyun is hurt. I can't risk it. Nope. Come on, Sayo Hyun. No, not, do not send her alone. Oh, shit. Um, will it be okay to send Sayo Hyun off like this? What if Sayo Hyun ends up in the middle of the ocean? There's no light around at all. What's going to happen to her if she has to drift in the dark like that? Especially with the tide around this island. It's not a good idea to send her off while the lighthouse light is off. Also, we have to go to the lighthouse. But I thought, like, like we could both just leave the island together, not send her off alone. What happened to the lighthouse? Oh, no. Oh, my God. Gina! God. It's too late. Who warns are way too severe. What the hell happened here? You son of a bitch. Jay! Is that you? Hey, Jihoon, old buddy. Oh my. You got cursed by the white flower too? What's been going on? And what happened to Sao Hyun? Don't come near me! Do you really think I could hurt Gina? Really? Then who's that girl behind you? I'm sorry, my friend. I don't want to do this either. But right now, I have no other choice. Say, so, run! The Lucky Charm coin dropped at the scene, and suddenly you changed your shirt. And that weird girl. But I just have to turn the light back on, even though I have to fight my way through Jay. I have to get Sarah Hewn off this island before I get cursed too. Uh, throw the chair at him! Shit. Uh, shoot him! What the fuck? Give him his lucky coin! I'm so confused. Step aside. Please, I'm begging you. I have to turn on that light. That's not important right now. You have no idea what's going on on this island. Yeah? You're talking about the air on the island, filled with the scent of the white flower, right? Huh? Did you figure that out too? That's right. I know that everyone on this island can turn into a vicious murderer. What the hell are you talking about? It doesn't matter. We gotta turn on the light back on first. I don't understand. 
Why are you so obsessed with that light? Jay is extremely agitated right now. I better try talking him down first. Um. Uh, escape. We need to escape. The island is just too dangerous. I'm going to help Sarah Hewn escape from the island, even if she has to leave alone. No way. You can't do that. No one can leave this island. Not even a single person. That will trigger a catastrophe. What do you mean? Can't you tell? The catastrophe has already started. If someone were to leave the island, a bigger catastrophe will start. We need Seo to stay on this island for our survival. Everyone's dying. Survival my ass. There's something wrong with him. He's acting as if we should all die together. Okay, let me save real quick, just in case if I make another bad mistake. Okay, that, that's good. I probably just killed myself already. You decided we needed to alert other people, didn't you? In that case, the best way to get it done is to light up the lighthouse like we promised before. Oh, that's what you meant. In that case, I agree. Let's light this place up. But it looks like a high voltage current is running through the wire that's unplugged. What are you going to do about it? Use the glove? If you would move? What the hell? Who are you? And why are you with Jay? Sonny. What are you doing, ji -hoon? You're scaring her. I literally just wanted to see who the hell she was. Can you... There must be a physical altercation in here. I'm so confused. It won't be too hard to turn it back on, since only a few wires are unplugged. If only I could touch them without electrocuting myself. Oh, I'm supposed to give you the gloves. Take this. Oh. This will work. Now, all we have to do is wait for the other people to show up here, huh? It could have taken forever to search the entire island. But... No! Sehun can't be with you any longer. What? What are you talking about? Safety. Look at this coin. Oh, you had it on you. This coin was dropped right beside a dead body. So, are you saying I was the one who killed him? I never said him. I never said him. I said dead body. I never said a gender, even though there was more guys than girls. Wait, now, nah, never mind, no. You're confusing me. I'm not jumping at any conclusions yet, but I believe you can understand why I have to be cautious. It really wasn't me. It must be hard to take in. It was the same for me in the beginning, too. Let's just stop arguing. Stop right there. Is he really not going to let us go? Uh, uh, evade. Have it your way. Since you're trying to do everything your way, I'll just do the same then. No. I have to stop you. No one can leave this island. Especially Seo Hyun. Why Seo Hyun especially? Is she, like, a part of this island? Like, is she one with the island? Like, if she leaves, the island will turn into... Turn alive and just kill everything in its path? That's the vibe I'm getting here. If you keep insisting like that, I'll use this gun if I have to. What? Are you serious? Hold it. Wait right there. I know Jay's not going to give up. I better hurry before he catches up with me. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, uh, let's go. Jihoon, stop right there. Man, he sat fast. He's already right behind me. I've got to speed up. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I didn't read what I said. Good. No one has been to this boat. Now all I have to do is get Sarah Hewn on the boat. Then my part will be done. Oh, good. Get on. What are you waiting for? Get on. Sarah Hewn. I'm doing the right thing by sending you off, right? Hold it right there. Don't try to stop me. Pointing the gun at me won't do any good. I will stop you. No matter what. Why? Why are you trying to stop me? If she even has the slightest chance to survive, I'll send her off. 
That's the only thing I can do for Seo Hyun. I know you're trying to protect Seo Hyun, but the things that are happening on this island aren't just an accident. It's not just about the curse of the white flowers. What are you talking about? I was barely able to find out, looking around this island. Seo Hyun knew everything about this island, from the very beginning. What? What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> Wait, I can do better. <laughs> Wait, I, I got this. <laughs> ah, my chest. Who? Who was that? You. You. <laughs> His eyes. They're not the same. Oh my god. Has he lost his mind because of the curse? No. This is not happening. I haven't even sent off Seo Hyun. I haven't even got her to safety yet. I can feel my body slowly getting cold. But everything is my fault. Why did I waste so much precious time arguing? I should have done something to prevent that from happening in the first place. I wish I could turn back the clock. I wish you could go back in time where it all began. Fucking shit, I saved the wrong time! Okay. Try that again. Let's see. Let's see. If we just talk to him first. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, let's alert. We just alert. We need the to alert people. Alright, here's your glove so you can fix a light. Blada blada blada. But we need to escape. We just need to escape. Um. Uh. Let's see. Uh. Is he really not gonna let us go? Uh. Stop him. Stop right there! I'll never let you lay a hand on Seo Hyun. Never! Ouch! Oh, I get it. You passed that a few times already, didn't you? You did too? Yeah, buddy. I have. That's why we can't waste our time like this. You're right. I just have to leave after all. Do you have to keep your guard up against me like this? I don't want to drag Seo Hyun into this. That's all. And you said you know the truth about the curse too. Surely you should understand me. Ji Hoon, stop right there. Please, don't stop me. Please. Hold it. Wait right there. He's not going to chase me right away, since I threatened him quite a bit. But if Jay is after Seo Hyun, he'll eventually follow sooner or later. Okay, so this is a change. This is a change, that's good. Jay's not going to make a move on me so easily, since he knows I got a gun. Is there any way I could keep Jay from chasing after me? Uh, shit. Maybe not. Oh my god, I'm dumb. Alright, he won't be able to get over here now. I feel sorry for Jay. But there was no other choice. Right now, Seo Hyun's safety is the only thing that matters to me. Okay, let's get to the boat. Let's hope the murderer isn't there. Now to do is get Seo on the boat, then my part will be done. Don't just monologue or look at her. Feel like sorry for her. Just get her on the boat, get her to safety, and get it out. Seo Hyun, I'm doing the right thing by sending you off, right? Did you really sleep through the boat leaving? I'm really sorry. I accidentally keep... Skipping the dialogue, I'm sorry. Why are you giving me a shot? Huh? Is there anything else in your mind? Okay. I don't know much about medicine. But long, as long as you want me to, I'll do it. Thank you, Jihoon. Why are you guys interested? I think this might have something to do with the professor. Jihoon, I think we better not talk about that. That's right. The police didn't do much about finding the professor in the first place. Jihoon, I wonder if the curse of the white flower might be much more intense than we first thought. Don't worry, Seo Hyun. I will definitely uncover what this is all about. I know Jay didn't do this. Once we gather everyone, I will... I never thought this island would be this dangerous. If I did, I would never... She did know. 
How much do I know about you? And how much do I not know? There's one thing I know for sure. Isana is a very dangerous place. Then... Goodbye. Dear friend. And girlfriend, I guess. I don't know if they were boyfriend and girlfriend. Forgive and forget. Oh no. I'm losing it again. Oh, that's just the boat. But now... Oh, he's losing consciousness. I'm alright. Because I know for sure you're going far away from here. Oh. Put sail on the boat. Now, now he's losing consciousness. I'm so dumb. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's a little too fast. What's going on? Whoa. That's a lot. That's fast. That's fast. Why are we so fast in time? That, oh, oh, it's showing how long he's been out. God, I'm dumb. 5.23 a.m. We've been out for a while. What the hell? Uh, was that it? Holy shit, that was it. I can't believe that. Okay. Wow. Well, I guess that's it for this episode. I'd like to thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy. And I'll catch you on the next one. Hasta la vista, baby.